I bought one. And I have one like that too. Yeah, it takes a little while. Well, you know what's really good too? Did you know Chris Hanhall? I posted that right. Uh, uh, almost every day. Uh, they, they did. Yeah. Uh, I posted that too. It's a little scary. Yeah. And, uh, and so you just listen to her 40 minutes. You know, okay. Okay. Uh, No cell phones, no cameras. What are you saying I can't do? I'm not inside the federal courthouse. Are you alleging that I was inside the federal courthouse? What are you going to do about me videotaping outside a federal courthouse? I'm just curious, sir, when you say I can't film outside of a federal courthouse, what exactly you're alleging? You don't control my movements. Why'd you reach your hand out? What were you trying to do? Behind my office. Okay. Have a nice day. Just don't, don't videotape inside the courthouse. I have a right to videotape outside the courthouse. Okay, you were videotaping inside. Okay. Thank you. I wasn't inside. So are you are you claiming I was inside a building I wasn't inside of? I'm looking through a window that's not being inside a building. So what you're saying is I can't film through the window, but you didn't say that because you can't say that because that's not true. Have a nice day. Please don't give people orders that aren't lawful. I can film what I want to film out here, and you can't stop me. That's my right. So I got a little space between me and the door. I want to like mm -hmm. document that this space is this. Thank you for standing up for your constitutional rights. Oh, thank you, sir. Glad that people recognize that. They can't be telling us what we can and cannot do. That's our rights out here. Well, if I knew you better, I'd treat you to a haircut. Anyway. Now you started down the So I've been texting people all day. Responsibility is here for you. Yeah. Oh, do me a favor. That's Would you have them send it to the plastic on the Then you are ready to do it. It would make their day, right? Until then, they don't see themselves. Well, I do, man. Pick up two things.
I think it says everything that they're afraid of people documenting what they're doing. Like if they're doing something in everyone's name and it's a public service, then why can't people see what it is? Why is it that at the door they're trying to stop us? Sure, did he ask you not to videotape inside? Am I inside the building? Mike, can you remove He's still videotaping at the end. All right. I have a right to videotape out here. Are you challenging my First Amendment rights? No one's challenging any First Amendment rights, so relax. You can't videotape inside the courthouse, that's all. Okay? I never went inside the courthouse. Okay, you can't stand outside and videotape inside the courthouse, okay? So, is this illegal right now? What I'm doing right now, you're saying that's illegal? Why are you doing that? You're challenging me, I'm not bothering you people. I didn't go up to you and start telling you you're doing something wrong. You came up to me and told me I'm doing something wrong. So what am I doing wrong? Explain it to me. That's right, nothing. I'm doing nothing wrong. Alright, well anyway, have a nice day. Listen, I'm gonna take you down to the barber shop and get him a haircut and you're gonna feel better. Okay? So even though I'm, I'm sure I have a right to film up there, I'm a, I am a little intimidated of even going back up on this platform because of how these people act, but I'm going to occupy this space, I'm, I don't know how many squares from the door, but I've got two angles running for my own protection. So is this illegal right now? So the man inside who instructed you to give unlawful orders, is that a U.S. Marshal? That would make him a public servant, and I'm curious as a member of the public what his name would be. You have to ask him. Mm -hmm. It just concerns me because people that wear badges and come out and give orders, it's almost as though they're, there's an inherent threat in everything that they do. And uh, supposedly they're doing a public service, like this guy that was arrested, I don't know him. I don't really know much about him at all, but I know it's strange that somebody kidnaps somebody and then hides them and then doesn't allow people to see them, doesn't allow there to be cameras nearby where they are. If it's a public proceeding, why aren't there cameras allowed in? Why, why is it that there is hidden information if it's in the name of the public? And as much as I disagree with the state courts, you're at least allowed to film inside of the state courts. Why is the federal government so secretive? I just went by the Doge, seems to be in that car, and I'm going to walk away from it because, well, there are a number of things that have just occurred that I'm going to turn off my backup for now.